Stroke is the fifth most common cause of death, and it's the number one cause of long-term disability. There aren't many medications that can help patients recover after a stroke, but there is a potential breakthrough on the horizon, a clinical trial using stem cells that are actually implanted into the brain. Channel 2's Christine Noel explains how it works and where you can sign up for this trial. A simple signature speaks volumes for Milena Buck. Milena had a stroke during college graduation. She couldn't write her name, walk, or even talk with her students. I was walking in a walker for a long time, and I couldn't move my hand. But then, through a university study, she received a drug made from stem cells. The drug was implanted in her brain near the site of the stroke. This is after the surgery. You can see her waving her right hand. I told the doctor, and he goes, they can't work that fast, but they did. I mean, the minute I got out of surgery, I could do things that I couldn't do before. Dr. Scott Bergen says most patients can feel the effects of the stem cells gradually. Preliminary research have shown that in these circumstances, it's very encouraging that using these cells can aid recovery. Dr. Bergen says right now, most stroke recovery treatments are limited to conventional therapy. This would be kicking the door open to an entire new realm of possibilities for, for people with the most disabling medical condition that would come across in the world. After the surgery, Malena's life changed dramatically. If it wasn't for them, for the stem cells, I would have just given up. Participants in the clinical trial must be ages 35 to 75 and have limited movements of their arms and legs 12 months after a stroke. We've linked more information about the study in the health section of clicktohouston.com. I'm Christine Noel, KPRC Channel 2 News.